How's it going everyone? This is Kevin. Today I want to bring along with me to do some sports photography with a Tamron 35-150 to and see how well it holds up. So let's jump right into it. Try some up close portraits. Oh, James is going to be famous right here. <laughs> Yes, because most of the time you're late. So if you do your split step as they're hitting, then you're ready early to be able to hit the right shot. Oof. Oof. ¿Qué pasó, señor? Ah, oh, GQ. GQ. All right. Good. Good follow throughs. Keep it up. Oh, she touched it, but yeah. yeah. All right. We can get this bed A ver si quieres avienta tu raqueta la otra vez así en el aire. Se sí, así nada más ahorita en el aire tanto. Pase más para adelante acá. Ajá, ahí. Y una. Haz otra vez. <laughs> sí. Well, using this lens is pretty versatile when it comes down to taking some, you know, sports photography. You get a lot of range with this lens, obviously. You get to do a lot more from up close and from farther, so I love it. But yeah, those are pretty much it with the photos for now. And I'm gonna give you my final thoughts 
here shortly once I'm home. And we're done basically with all the photos. You got to see them. I was going to wait until I was heading home, but I got to just go through them real quick. And this is stuff that I've done because I've already taken photos with this lens setup and camera already. I use it for my social media for my tennis academy. But one of the things that I really truly love about this lens is just it's really fast with the autofocus with the camera. It doesn't really get doesn't really miss focus really much. Sometimes if I don't move it right, it might not. But overall, it's very versatile because it can be up close. I can be from farther. I can get those wide establishing shots from the whole you know person playing tennis. Or if I want to get more up close and personal to just get more details like that has been pretty cool in my honest opinion so I mean that's just for me how it is when it comes down to this uh, um, I guess lens setup I think the Tamron 35 to 150 has just become my biggest workhorse and I've made a, quite a few videos of it already sorry if you're getting tired of it but I do really love this lens and obviously I have to do some videos about it since I'll have people asking me questions all the time about it and also well it's my main setup now so it is what it is with that end but <sighs> my arms getting tired um yeah that's pretty much when it comes down to the setup with for sports photography with the Tamron 35 to 150 i think it does a really great job i don't know what you guys think of the photos and how they turn out did you think it was you know great would you use it for any sports setting obviously if you're farther back you might need more of like that 100 to 400 or maybe even more because depending on the sport that you're you know photographing you might have to be farther away but for something that kind of gets you a little bit more closer contact i think this setup is quite phenomenal because i don't need to be that far away from the player so i can take cool photos from up closer and even the video i showed you a bit of footage with it as well so that way you can see that and you know you can get an idea of what you can create with the tamron 35 to 150 for video as well well all in all i think this setup is great so Thank you for watching this with me and you know kind of making it you know enjoyable with your your eyes for watching it and hopefully you enjoyed it um, i put a bit of pieces together as well of on, uh, what i was doing before i was setting it up with the pov style but i had uh, my um, little part was kind of getting in the way of the camera so i had to do other ones as well but you got everything to see so that's just so you get an idea yeah this lens setup is really great so hopefully it's something that answers any questions if it comes down to if you wanted to know if it could do some sports photography or not but with all that said and done guys thank you so much for watching this video make sure to like and subscribe share this video with a friend i'll catch you guys in the next one see ya